in Pasadena. There's only five minutes. Is it this one? You can see the illuminated lights of homes. Uh, uh, this is a 37 mile per hour chase. That they are driving through. This isn't even a this chase. Is a very dangerous this is just situation. two people going in the same they direction in a commute bring, home from work. These officers want to bring this to a very safe conclusion at this time. And they're tracking this individual. Oh, it's in live. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I forgot there's a different section for this now. Just going about their business to now be thrust in the middle of this pursuit. Yeah, there, th there's no question. So this is on surface streets, and you can see with our extreme nav system, look to the upper uh, side of your screen here on Altadena Drive. A lot of tree coverage and here. Suspect, and we still don't know the want. Is that correct, Alex and Christine? Do you guys have any information? Have any intel? Okay, bottom line. This, this is, is the wrong one again? Up, you know? How many police chases happened today? Oh my God, wait, there was two. <laughs> Holy fuck, look at the amount of police cars in this one. What is that wanted level? That will block that vehicle from moving on if they... Jesus Christ! Yeah, and you look at those lights that are on the window there, you wonder if they might use a less than lethal force to shoot out the window, which we've seen in the past too, depending on the urgency of this. It'd be interesting to know more information about what led to this. Okay, they, I feel like the second he tries to take off, they're just going to shoot. I can't watch that on Twitch. I thought you said it was a police chase, not like a like a firing squad on this Camry. Is there some septic in Mando? They don't. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. They don't. That's a pretty sizable law enforcement presence, mm -hmm. uh, which which leads you to believe this this may be um, a more serious charge uh, that we're talking about here. You also got to be concerned about, and maybe they're going to stop the traffic. Maybe they have, quick. like they have. They did. I, it was scary to me that there was all that cross traffic hey. and, and the prospect of some sort of shooting and people being stuck in that. And now it looks like they have stopped uh, people in both directions as they focus on this suspect. Yeah, as I mentioned that, and you saw two units just a, a few moments ago there move into the direction ahead of- How the fuck does he get out of this? Facing ...to prevent, hopefully, any other vehicles from coming in the opposite direction or preventing this car, this suspect, from going any farther. LA's so turned into GTA. Bit, uh, Bro, these police chases are so common now. Right in that area. It is actually nuts. I wonder if it was always like that. Um, the main issue for law enforcement is that they go home safely. Uh, if you all, if you look at the driver, though, it seems to me that the driver is making some motions in that vehicle. Seems to be a little bit of movement there. Um, looks like some hands. Wrong one. The high-speed pursuit on 101 time. freeway is the one that got away. How many have happened today? What the fuck do you mean? This guy does like somehow engage in a chase. Street. Condition. Oh, maybe not. About the driver. This vehicle. Let's see how the wheels work. Well, since that stand <laughs> cell phone. The deputy. It looks like a male there driving. Like a, there he goes again. Okay. <laughs> it looks like a male there driving, and he's picking up speed now. This is the quickest we've seen him. Just, that first that speed. was the slowest acceleration of all time. What is that? Zero to sixty in five minutes. Communicate with them. And he's like, oh, well, I, I'm just gonna. There he goes again. I'll just. Okay. I'll give it a try. It looks like a male there driving, and he's picking up speed now. This is the quickest we've seen him since that standoff first started. And this is close to the 60. There's a <gasps> deputy vehicle there holding off traffic. You wonder if what what <laughs> what in tarnation? Easy to yeah. set it up in but this now, scenario. This is a pursuit again, everybody. You're watching it live here on Fox 11. The, on the, this is <laughs> they have the whole department here. Whoa, wait, what? They had they have to be doing this for like farming ad revenue off YouTube. How? There's like 80 police officers here. They even come up to the window. That they're done with this. The L.A. County Sheriff's Department is going in here and going to try to bring this to an end. Uh, they just threw. It looks. How to how does he get out of this? Sort of device that looks like a spike strip. They're staring at him. The back vehicles, and there they go. There they go. Oh, oh spike strip. You're right. Wow. Off. I'm not sure. I've seen that before, where they do the spike strip right wow. there. The car stalled. Pursuit is on again. Let's see. And then he stops again. <laughs> okay. Nothing. 
Cat and mouse continues. Mental stability, yes. There's so many officers. They just—he slowly just gets away. And, uh, and they won't give up. Still the it's like the turtle in the hair, I guess. Cell phone, something. And, Are they trying uh, and to flash back? the helicopters there? Yeah, and looking back big boy. at the deputies there, uh, trying to communicate with them, and there they go. There he goes again. Okay. It looks like a male there. Bye bye. He's picking up speed now. This is the quickest. He's still at the speed limit. That standoff first started. This isn't high speed and yet. This is close to the 60. There's a deputy vehicle there holding off traffic. You wonder if they'll have another spike strip maybe set up. I mean, it would be easy to yeah. set it up in but this now, scenario. This is a pursuit again, everybody. You're watching it live here on Fox 11. Unclear of the water. Bang! Threading the needle. See? Right through there. <laughs> <laughs> and it's on. You can see a night sun there, so that obviously Jesus is Christ. A helicopter there. Literally this is one of the goofier ones. They had this guy vehicle. like Let's see how the kaput. Look. It looks down, right? That back left tire? Yeah. That looks definitely looks flat. Yeah, no, they Even they the definitely popped his tires. From our vantage point so there. perhaps job well done with that spike strip there, but it was scary to see that driver making his or her way through those deputies, those other police vehicles, and to see other trucks. Okay, there's no way he gets again, away stopping again. again. Stopping mm -hmm. randomly in an intersection here. Well, and, and it's well it looks like he does somehow get, get out. In the back. We've seen situations where trunks have opened. He's literally like filming a TikTok a right now. Uh, yeah. Be in the back of a, a vehicle in, in that capacity. Bottom line, another standoff here. We'll see if this uh, individual, he, lots of movement, really. Thanks, uh, Lisa. Inbridge, Granny, and, we'll see and Frozen, and here Timmy, and Golf, vehicle, and Taco. They were trying to. You saw, well, you, know, the, you saw what they were doing there, and they had yeah. the, on again. Here we go. He, he, okay. Where, does he just decide to slow down sometimes and then yeah. wait? Yeah. And let's see what, how much control this driver That's, has. Yeah, no question that, uh, that those, those tires have limited the capacity of this vehicle. On and off, stop. Uh. Oh, uh oh. Oh, uh, oh yeah, that's that's that's, okay. that's gonna be where this uh, one ends. We never, we never know. Like Screaming. again, suicide. You know, you know that. Uh -oh. um, we've seen an awful situation well, like this. Oh, got out of the vehicle. Uh, clearly uh, agitated. Enforcement with stuff in your hands as they all have no. guns drawn. And and and, and this this <laughs> this man is very lucky at this point. You could see the other deputies there. Uh, I think the officers were just bored. They just wanted something to do. The like, you, yeah, there. you can just keep going. Oh. Wilcox, uh, Avenue there. This is better than uh, what we were doing at the uh, office this, anyway. This, this driver's underneath the overpass. Now, you can see the night send that illuminated block to just the view. Is that there are where they obviously in turn. How does this go That's on for 28 had, minutes? Two, parking. Here is, here's what everybody else around. Point. Make it so. Uh, okay, that's definitely the end. Still on to, uh, we are in human nature. So let's see okay. what happens. That was a weird one. So which one were you talking about? If that wasn't the one where the guy gets away. <clears throat> Look at the resub Presidio, Zach, Smitty, and the Prime tweeter in the resub Easter. It was Fox 5. Oh, is it Fox? Is it not Fox Five LA? Oh, Fox Five Atlanta. You sure? Where? There's the bits, Amy. I just checked their live. There's the only thing from today is these two. Neither one of these is a police chase. High speed pursuit 101 freeway. It was Fox 11. It was the f Was this the first one we went to? I think it was. Well, we're going to be in the Hollywood area right there. That black vehicle that you're seeing is the one that is being pursued. But I have to be very clear about this. Because of all this high rate of speeds, this crazy driving, and it has been 
crazy driving uh, this afternoon. They backed off. All the black and whites have backed off, but believe me, they are in the area and they are nearby. The helicopter above is mm, the good move. helicopter making the calls, keeping an eye on where this vehicle is. Now he's going to ramp it off of a parked tow truck. Vehicle, and they really believe Never that to be seen are. again. The way, these, uh, the way these persons are driving, they definitely have something that they do not want one, to be stopped for. A man with a gun call is the original call, as I understand it. We're just getting that from our assignment desk. Melissa giving that information. And you see what we're man, talking about Man, he is really right fucking there. pumping Those dicks down this street. A, My a God. very residential area, high speeds, and that's not the only thing that we've seen. He's actually almost hit or just basically swapped paint with a black and white with an uh, LAPD officer when the officer was in the area stopped. This car keeping driving keeping these and Cuda. extremely high speeds. I'm going to get that map up here in just a moment. Uh, definitely in the Hollywood area and right now as I understand it we are on Kingsley and we've made our way into the Koreatown area and this one is one of the ones where I've got to be really careful on what we're doing because the way these people are driving Ooh. this uh, this afternoon and the reason for the want I've got to be very, very careful because if this... Man, he is man, really you can pushing it here. He's zooming. He's, this person is to get away from law enforcement. What What's happening to the, the sportscaster here? What was that? Indigestion? Well, it's been in the Hollywood area the what whole time. It noise? was on the freeway for there for a few moments. We were up doing another story that was going on in the valley. Our assignment desk gave us the heads up that this was going on. We started listening to it, made our way over here. But, uh, you know, let's just keep an eye on what's going on at the moment. Uh, this vehicle is still making his way through the... Uh, I always ask, yeah, did you know that FTX... Gino, Rooney, and the Prime Casa, Yusuf Donzu. Anybody that's ever driven in, in, down in this area, especially around this time of the day... Knows that Anyone that's ever driven in LA knows how miserable it is. Compact. Shit the sucks. Drivers in this area also, Doesn't matter where you are. They're basically minding their own business, and then you've got this lunatic driving around out here. Maybe that wasn't the right word, but look at how this person is driving this afternoon. And now we're back at least onto a major. I believe we're back on Vermont. Vermont was one of the streets that he was on originally. Maybe he knows this area. Maybe he does. He's a tier but one right now, squee in the prime. Speeds, Adam and Risa Infinity. Calls, and that car really starting to work, work this area. You've never been to so LA? Yes, I have. I fucking hated it. Absolutely hated it. How they're going to do this safely? They want to bring this thing to an end. Clearly, uh, they have officers in the area. We've seen this car making back onto the 101. We've seen officers in this area. We've seen this car drive by other police officers, and we've heard them on the radio saying, "Turn off the turn off the lights and sirens." They're just trying to calm this person down a little bit. Keep an eye on where he's going. Where he's going? Well. Back onto the they don't have right the speed now. gauge up on, on this one, unfortunately, so I don't know up, what numbers he's pushing here. But he looks like he's so he really going for it. Date. I'm going to show the uh, speed and also the uh, locations. Oh, there we go. There it is. There's that production value. Okay. We got the street names. We can now monitor the speed. Beautiful. Ever since these police chases really took off on YouTube, they've invested a lot of resources into making them a really exciting spectator sport. Jeez. Oh, Jesus, right. What a squeeze. That's right. It, you know, and this is the thing. Speeding on the freeway, we're well into the 100 mile an hour, at the, into the triple digits. That car, look at it, just swerving back and forth out there, 80, 90 miles an hour on the 101, just passing. I, I believe that Toby was Vermont. And cranky and, and body that, and this, tomahawk. this car just moving along, high speeds. LAPD, they are in pursuit, and again, they're just keeping an eye on it. The window's down for the first time. We can kind of get a little bit of a glimpse of the driver. Uh, you can see that. Why did he know, roll down the window? Looking out the window, driving, just, I, you know what? This is one of those ones where I just can't even keep up. This guy is driving so erratic. I'm just worried so much about any of these other folks that are on the road today. Many, many close calls. We understand that he actually did hit a black and white, a, a law enforcement vehicle earlier on. Man with a gun call. That's also going to be part of the part of this when this comes to. How the fuck end. does he escape? Because apparently that they haven't 
they don't have no reason to believe that that weapon is not in that vehicle right now. They understand that there's two people in the car, maybe more. But Please that, give some that's Tony one of the reasons why they were asking for additional units earlier on, meaning more officers to uh, engage in this pursuit or be in the area when this comes to an end because there's going to be more than one person in that car. At least I can say that the speeds have slowed down, and I can't believe looking up we're going 90 miles an hour on the 101 freeway. I have to imagine the reason he rolled down the window is to throw something out of it. Bit of a wider shot You're probably we're right. We're way into the valley, so we're going up uh, in, through the Coanga Pass right now. That vehicle still moving very, very quick, and uh, LAPD, they are in tracking right now, meaning there is no black and whites behind Thanks us, the prime, no Gideon. lights and sirens, the public not really being warned about what's going on, and he's still driving very erratic. Now we need a good Samaritan to engage in the chase there. with him and get him with that pit maneuver. A, lot of these folks, and like you said earlier, a crazy plot no, twist. Ooh, ooh, nobody knows what's really going on. It's just somebody driving really, really fast. But again, this person is concerned about getting away and not really paying attention to what's in front of him. I'm just very Zero worried about the public. I don't want to see this end poorly. Oh, what did the... What is this? No closure? Well, how the fuck does he get away? Does this one have the whole thing? In the area here, and as we've oh, been talking, we you know, a lot of the people... Possible that vehicle is still under the... Or offer the oh, he actually did the uh, classic movie stunt of going back to the overpass really and trying busy. to escape. Uh, surprisingly, Ventura doesn't look as as packed as it often is around lunchtime. With the they're trying to get this driver to calm. He will just sort okay, of calm down and head perhaps to his Sabasi. home or another place to get out of the vehicle. Sorry for the spoiler. The vehicle, it's much safer. Mm. If he can get out of the vehicle, then they can at least take him into custody. Okay, now we're getting off at Lancashire Boulevard. This is in Universal City. Uh, this Ooh. is Ooh. on the other side. This is on the north side of the pass. But now he is heading, um, that looks like southbound on Lancashire. Yeah, there's a gas station right there. This is uh, this is now in Studio City, Amy. Should be Ventura Boulevard. And again, you that guy's using a turn signal. It's definitely not him. Has, uh, Nevada place. We don't know oh, did he turn around? Oh, my God. There's so many options. There's going to be a lot of congestion uh -oh. in the area here. And as we've been talking, you know, a lot of the people. This guy's driving like shit. It could be this school. guy. They're off work, and uh, this is certainly. Well, no, it's probably it is actually that probably that guy. Really busy. Uh, surprisingly. No, not, probably not this one. The other one. As packed as it often is. Oh fuck! Time with the what happened? How did wait? What? What just happened in there? Like four black cars all came out of there, and they all looked like the the same make and model of the car. Wait, what the fuck was that? Was this was this rehearsed? Did he call in reinforcements? Like boys. I need five, five black Camrys parked under this overpass. Stat. I need to blend in like Assassin's Creed. Mirage alt. <laughs> Chiru. Uh, this okay, is so that's definitely side. him. And then here... What, what are the odds? Look at this. So this is not him, but it's the, like the exact same car. Okay, interesting. The north side of the pass, but now he is heading... Um, that looks like southbound... On Lancashire, yeah, there's a gas station right there. Another this one. Is, uh, this is now in Studio City, Amy. Oh this man. Boulevard, and again, you were mentioning Mark that these. He just got a crazy lucky break in there. Nevada place. We don't know if this person is familiar with the area, but there's going to be a lot of congestion in the area here. And as we've been talking, you know, a lot of the people out right now. I really think it's this guy, though. Work and uh, the guy grinding the line there, debating on whether or not to make some really crazy busy. moves. Uh, I really think that was the. I think that was your boy. As packed as it often is around lunchtime with a lot of folks going out to lunch and perhaps that's because so many of the people that work in the area are off for the holidays but um, certainly a uh, tricky situation uh, sky nine trying to keep a close eye on this car but it looks like we're uh, bottom right he did a u-turn you know what mm, Amy, maybe we're not the only ones looking for this I can hear the air commander asking for anyone who had eyes on this vehicle to give them a description they are looking for a black Honda Civic uh, and they did have the license plate, or I should say it's a black Honda. I know that for sure. I thought that I heard them say Civic, but it looks like the air air unit is also searching for this vehicle. Now you can see LAPD units coming up off. The Damn! Road. Holy shit! Back. Wait, he actually did just that escape. Is still under the overpass, but Sky Two did. It's not under the overpass. I'll tell you right now. Or under the overpass. Vehicles come out the other side of. Oh yeah, he, he's definitely like he's definitely fucked. They they got the plates, I'm sure, but this was a. What a what a stunt here to escape. Let me see. He can at least take him into custody. Okay, is there anything like identifiable here? Boulevard. This is in Universal City. Uh, this Ooh. is on the other side. This is on the north. I can't tell. It looks like he has like blacked out rims, but so does this car. It seems. 
side of the pass, but now he is heading, um, that looks like southbound. On There's silver, was yeah, there silver trim? Right I didn't there. see this that. Is, uh, this is now in Studio City, Amy. Should be Ventura Boulevard, and again. It's definitely not him using that turn signal, 0% chance. Has, uh, Nevada plays we don't it could be this guy, well, no, actually, I don't think so. That doesn't seem to be a Honda know if this person is familiar with the area but there's gonna be a lot of congestion in the area i just really think it's this guy because he comes out all like cattywampus like he comes out dazed here and as we've been talking you know a lot of the people out right now is this not the same car no trim yeah i guess not they're out of school they're off work and uh this someone in chat had an interesting idea that might be true he could have gone under here and then cranked a u-turn and then just came out this way driving totally natural which i think is possible this certainly this he is getting see him going one more time hold this driver to closer but L this uh, yeah so it's definitely got the silver trim closer, but LAPD so it wasn't that guy I was wrong he is doing that tactic where they're trying to get this driver to calm down a little bit by putting the lights and sirens a lot further behind him or maybe turning those lights and sirens mm -hmm. off at all hoping that maybe he, he did just use a turn signal actually perhaps to his home or another place to get out maybe of it was the turn signal guy of the vehicle it's much safer mm -hmm. at Lancashire Boulevard this is on the other side this is on the north side of the pass but now he's okay, right there see. this is uh this is now in Studio City Amy should be Ventura Boulevard and again you I can't see did he ha did that have the trim on it I can't tell it's too deep there this is uh, uh this is now in studio city Amy no maybe it is I think I think I can kind of see it I can't tell it's it's too high now in studio city Amy should be Ventura Boulevard and again no it doesn't look like it has a silver trim these. This car has uh, Nevada plates. We don't know if this person is familiar with the area, but there's going to be a lot of congestion in the area here. He also had lighter and rims. Oh, did talking, he? I didn't even look you know, at that. A lot of the people out right now. Not they're this guy. Sleep, they're off work, and uh, this is certainly wow. uh, surprisingly been true. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, it's this guy. Wait, this is absolutely it. Wait, this is him. It was the third guy that came out. Yeah, it's definitely the third guy. This is the same car. Cause, yeah, silver trim. And it even has the lighter stuff you mentioned. No blue on the plate? Did it have blue on the plate going into it? Fuck. Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> Jesus. How many cars... How many of these Hondas were under that over under the overpass? Jesus. And yeah, you're right. That's not the same guy. It doesn't have the blue on the plate. How the fuck is that possible? Yeah, man went under there and hit the shadow clone jutsu. Wow. As as packed as it often is around lunchtime with a lot of folks going out to lunch, and perhaps that's because so many of the I do think what probably area. did happen is he went under here, did that U-turn, and then came out like driving natural. And that would also explain why this car comes out like all fucked up because he maybe like swerved to get out of the other guy's way so now he's all like discombobulated so like right here he's probably in here with that u-turn now going this way and he just poops out that way area here and as we've been talking you know a lot of the people out right now they're out of school they're off work and uh this is certainly an area that can be really busy uh surprisingly wow. ventura doesn't okay. watching the did see a bunch of dark colored vehicles come out the other side of that is crazy uh, luck from that guy see, uh, that uh, the driver is able to get away uh, they are searching there for any black sedans there but Thanks, Risa Fresco it is, uh, and economics in the tier one they are reporting again this began just a Rada, little afternoon Nusa about 1204 uh, Musty, of a Deco, and Tier 1 Violet and Prime we Fosty. You, this is a black Here's sedan a with Nevada plates. We don't know if that person is from the area or not, uh, but we did see this uh, driver just going really, really fast on surface streets and extremely fast on the highway. And, uh, you know, of course, on the highway, they are not able to do spike strips. They're not able to do pit maneuvers. But it is a more dangerous situation on these surface streets because wow. you have 
uh, pedestrians out there. You've got people completely unaware of this car coming up on them so quickly. So really just not a good situation either way on the highway or on the surface streets. They ditched the car under they fast. ditched the car under and the street. You have to keep in mind that this person stream. does have a gun reportedly in that car. There are dark tinted windows. You don't know exactly how many people are in the car. We were reporting, Mark, I believe you said two cars, and we're showing video on the right side of the screen, which is shot earlier. Okay, um, uh, Amy, uh, I, I, just, I wanted to jump in here for just a second. I'm looking at the radar, and I'm seeing basically the noses of all of the helicopters, both law enforcement and media, pointing southbound on the 101, including us. I just heard the air commander. We may have found this vehicle on the southbound. Oh, no way. As you can see, Sky 9 is right on the tail of that LAPD airship. We believe that airship may have found it, so I think we're trying to get Sky 9 into position to try and find this vehicle on the southbound 101 right now. Yeah, this uh, driver just going so fast. And, and Mark, even though it's an out-of-state plate, it makes you wonder... Well, I don't want to see the, the old footage here. I want to see where they, where he's at now. And uh, knew exactly what they were doing and trying to... Take uh, me to the, the hot pursuit here. There were not, cruisers not the best of moments. ...behind the car because... They were actually trying to get this driver to slow down a bit because he was so reckless. Oftentimes they will back off of their ground pursuit and just keep a bird's eye view. And we do know that that's what they were doing. Law enforcement up above uh, keeping Thanks a close eye. But sometimes when they go under those uh, overpasses, uh, it can be tricky to keep a close eye on them. And they, it appears on the uh, left side of your screen there, they are still looking for the car in the area. What we're showing you on the right side of your screen is so they this find driver like, what's up with that? On and then made its way over to the Hollywood. The good news is, is that a LAPD pursuing unit at one point was close enough to this field vehicle to get the exact numbers on that plate. So they will have that. They will be able to put a be on the lookout report for this vehicle okay, with so the they exact didn't get it. license they didn't plate find number. Them. So that's good. The bad news is now I am hearing the air unit asking for any ground units to come up on the radio and talk to them about where they last saw this vehicle. So now I think that that report that maybe they had spotted this Rough. guy on the southbound 101 turns out to be another just the, just the wrong vehicle. It was another wow. black Honda. They checked the license plate and it wasn't the right one. So we are back to square Police one. Police searching for pursuit suspect airship, on the same uh, channel looking, says the driver uh, ditched the car and got into here, a white Jeep. Um, by Universal Studios. A lot has changed over the last. It was a video. Oh my God, another chase. Jesus. This one. Uh, Sky 9 over Studio City. This is where a pursuit uh, driver ditched his car for a new one. Police were in pursuit of that black car. Wow. Uh, but now we're being told that when that car went over that overpass, this is at Lancashire Boulevard and Universal City, they were able to get out of their black car and get into a white Jeep. Right now, we don't know if that driver had someone working with them and picked them up or well, if yeah. this was a carjacking, we are still waiting on word from officers exactly how the person who was leading them on a pursuit was able to get That is so fucking big brain. 100% what must have happened is he made a call while on the interstate. So he kind of phoned it in on the interstate and was like, okay, look, I'm going to need you to meet me <laughs> under the overpass at this spot. I'm coming in hot. Like this is actually some shit out of the Italian job movie. Or I guess it's possible that he ditched the car and then stole another one GTA style. Either one is likely. Assuming this is accurate. Though I don't know why they'd lie about him ditching the car. Though I guess what... Here's another one. I'm, gonna, I'm throwing out all possible options. What could have happened is since none of the ground units saw that happen. I'm imagining they're relying on witness testimonies from like pedestrians in the area. Maybe one of them was in on it, and they're like, oh, yeah, 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 that guy in that black car that was driving recklessly? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He uh, he got out into a, a clown car, a, a purple clown car. Oh, and they went uh, southbound. Like, it could have just been a lie from the start. Thanks, the said Nick, Fundy, Cook, and Rusty. Damn, this is a this is actually a pretty wild one. This has so many like.
possible explanations to get out of that black car and into the white Jeep, but they are now looking for that driver in a white Jeep. Again, this started out as a pursuit just after noon this afternoon in Koreatown. We were told it was a hostile man with a gun. We were also told that there were two people inside that black car. Uh, again, we are still waiting for word on if the search is continuing for that white Jeep. We, of course, will keep you posted as soon as we get new information. Wow. This was seven hours ago. Did they ever catch him? I'm imagining not. I'm assuming the car was stolen, so the plates are kind of worthless would be my guess. Go look for the Jeep in the original stream. Okay, let's see. All right. Let's and see if we can see a Jeep leave. That can be out right now. They're so we're looking for a white Jeep an area that can be puking really out busy. somewhere over here. Uh, surprisingly, Ventura doesn't look as as packed as it often is around lunchtime with a lot of folks going out to lunch and perhaps that's because so many of the people Or it could be over here somewhere but we're not going to see this side but, because um, of the, the chopper's position. a uh, tricky situation. Uh, Sky 9 trying to keep a close eye on this car but it looks like we're uh, struggling to Yeah and you know what Amy them. we're not the only ones looking for this. I can a hear white the Jeep just pulled in for Where? anyone who had eyes on this vehicle. We're not the only ones to yeah. close in. People that work back is it that can be off work. You know, Where did you see that? With the area, but there's going to be a lot of congestion in the area here. And as we've been talking, you know, a lot of the people out right now, they're out of school, they're off work. And uh, this is certainly an area that can be really Where? busy. Uh, surprisingly, Ventura doesn't look on the right. It was on the right side. He said a white Jeep pulling in. There's this. I don't think this is a white Jeep pulling in, though. This is coming out. And I don't even think that's a Jeep. Is that a Jeep? I can't tell. It's fucking blurry. It's coming in on this side? Where? This is this is leaving, by the way. It, this, this is leaving, not coming in. On the off-ramp. How are you guys even seeing this with all the pixelation? What the fuck are you talking about? This is certainly an area that can be really busy. Uh, surprisingly, Ventura doesn't look as, as packed as it often is around lunchtime with a lot of folks going out to lunch. And perhaps that's because so many of the people that work in the area are off for the holidays. But That's not a Jeep, is it? No, that's definitely not a Jeep. Is that a Jeep? I guess it could be. I don't think it is, though. It looks more just like a normal SUV. Like the resub Mac, Sporksy in the Prime, Newton and Matt, and Happy in the resub Nick. Could be a Cherokee. Let me see. It could be a Cherokee. Yeah, it could be a white Jeep Cherokee. It's just like all, like every goddamn car design is like exactly the same nowadays. They're all so uniform. It's so hard to distinguish different makes and models now. That could be fucking anything. That could be a Kia. Like, I mean, that could be literally anything. Area or off for the holidays, but um, certainly a uh, tricky situation. Uh Regardless, though, pretty big brain. I, although I don't even know if it was big brain or if he just got extremely fucking lucky. That was a that was a very wacky police chase. They hopped in the invisible boat mobile. That'd be huge. <laughs> Can you fucking imagine? They go into the underpass and then the outside is the paddy wagon. <laughs> oh man, that'd be a that'd be a hype chase. They probably just like give up on the pursuit right then and there.